some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Boyd County, Kentucky, where Craig and his buddies demand to film in a courthouse. Well, we all know how this is going to end. He's going to take a ride to see his new friend, Bubba. So, let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I don't think they're going to be bad here, man. Sorry. Can't film inside the building. Is that a law? That's a law? I believe it's prohibited to film inside the building. Where does it say a that? Public building? This is a public building, isn't it? Hold on. Can we get this figured? Is it is it prohibited? Is there like a thing up here that says it? I just want to make sure. What all is in this building? Is the clerk of courts in here? Okay. okay. Please remove. It will be returned once you have passed through the metal detector. Items prohibited include, but are not limited to, pocket knives, wallet, chains, and other large or other large chains, keys, lanyards, nail files, anything with a blade, regardless of the size, firearms, pepper spray, and any other items as determined by security. These items may be returned to your per vehicles or thrown away. They cannot be held for you or left hidden outside. And see that, and the reason that you have the right to search us, according to the executive order, yeah. is for weapons, right? Yeah. So th this wouldn't really fall under that, to, in, at least to me. Oh, come on now, Craig. You know just as well as anybody else that the courthouse is a non-public forum and the judge has say over what can happen in that courthouse. So stop being so damn stupid. You gonna get a, your supervisor here? Alrighty. Yeah, yeah. No problem, brother. Do your thing. A few moments later. Why? Why is it? No, why? It's a security risk. What? Oh, why no. are you? I'm not a security risk. No, I'm. I'm here. I'm here. It helps with the story. Where it helps for my story if I can get good scenes, skimming the walls, showing the architecture, showing the the trees and whatnot. Okay. There's. It's not a security risk. That's nonsense. Okay. Did you talk to our head of security? No, we only talked. No, to you. but you, the, everything was going you guys. Away. Well, you guys being. I, I, he's right there. He was talking to our Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So I'm not with him. I'm Yeah, I'm not with him. I um I honestly don't know what the problem is. I think that you being employed by the county, the rules that you're paid to enforce are the laws with you know, regards to this courthouse. You know, you've gotta really love it when uneducated morons like these frauditors think that they're going to educate those who have had training in these specific areas. It is really freaking laughable to me. There's no law prohibiting any... Okay, I any just ask that you speak to our head of security. Well, okay. No, I just ask that you guys respect my right to, I just wanted to, to film in, in public and be yeah, a journalist public. in public. I it's the first amendment. I just ask that you speak to him. If okay. To just step I actually don't have an interest. I don't have an interest to speak with him. Okay. It's not against the law yeah. to do what and I'm doing. Okay I'm like, I don't know what else to say. Clerk of courts? I don't know why That's it's so okay. difficult to let a camera in. Why would you sequester the clerk of courts so the public can't see? Oh my. You guys like you you guys realize that like if there's an, if the law doesn't say you can't do it, then you can do it. Because the law there's so many things that you can do, the law can't simply it can't provide for everything that you're allowed to do. So the way the law works is it provides for the things that you aren't allowed to do. But there's no law saying we can't do this. Yeah, they picked the shorter list. You guys admitted right. that you guys don't know the law, you want me to speak to the head of security. I'm just asking that you guys learn your jobs. Like I don't we're being all secretive. She's going to call some county attorney or some bullshit like. All I hear coming out of your mouth is a bunch of uneducated babbling coming from somebody who likes to tell people how to do their jobs when he doesn't know how to do their jobs at all. Did you just say we want to cause problems, man? Oh, no. No, I just want to. You see did, the didn't you? 
You did. I just got it on camera, yeah. dude. We don't no, want to cause problems. I'm a private journalist. Uh, well, why? why can't we talk because right I'd here? Like to talk to you. Okay, we can talk well, right here, there's man. There's business going on here. Let's go yeah, right yeah. here. Well, there's, okay, there's business going on. Like, I don't know what this is all about, guys. What do you mean now? Is that an order? Is that an order? Let's go out here. Yes, it is. Okay, what's going to happen if I don't? That's up to you. No, it isn't. I'm not going to force you to violate me. I have a right to be here. Let's go outside here and we'll talk about you. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, okay, you, you, you can't. You can't. You're going to physically assault us because we want to see the clerk of courts? Are you really doing this? Because we're trying to see this. Are you trying to talk to people? Yes. You fucking thug? <laughs> okay. That's oh, oh, what's going on here? Oh my! You getting all this? Yeah, I, I wanted to see the clerk. Did he? This guy's out of control. Yeah. It's our side. No, absolutely. Out of control. Somebody's taking away a legal order. It was a legal order. As a matter of fact, I asked you to step outside. You did. You did not. That, that wasn't a legal action. order if you asked. You're about to mess up big time. You can't just come as a beast and ask me a question. And uh, maybe we were retired here one of these days. And I'm that fool. You know, uh, I hope you got that too. Okay. So you can I'm call us morons, but when he calls you a thug, you can put him in handcuffs. They didn't put you in handcuffs because you called him a thug. They could put you in handcuffs because you were being belligerent. You were told to stop filming in a non-public form, and you continued to film. This is on you, dude. It's not on them. Why? 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 Well, there you go. You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. That was a nice walk of shame you took right there, Craig. Bravo!